Stevenson gets the 23-7 win over Eastern in the MAC Commonwealth semifinals. Glenn Clark with head coach Paul Cantabene. Coach, if your team plays like this, is there anybody in the country they can't beat? Well, you know, I mean, that's what we're about. You know, we got to play, especially in offense. If you play as a unit, uh, we're trying to tell them to think we're pretty good. We share the ball, we move off the ball really well, and, we can, and we're pretty tough to do that. When we start to play as individuals and force things that we did a few times today, uh, we're not so good. And so I think that you know, I think our team does a great job of that for the most part. You know, ever since we played these guys the first time, 13 12s we're averaging around 20 goals a game so I think they really kind of picked up what, how we have to play and and I'm really proud of them especially the young guys we're playing a lot of young guys in there those three freshmen have done a great job but our seniors have also done a great job leading us and which is also great you know what I mean we're just playing with that we just got to play with that discipline uh, the same way and, and I think we played tough all year I, I mean we've done plays a lot of really good teams I think we played tough which is another really good aspect of, uh, that I really like about this team does it mean something more to you that they came out and played like this in a playoff game with the season at stake that, that they showed that they were ready for this moment? Well, I didn't, I didn't think we are going to win 23-7, to right. seven, but, you know. Because I mean, we, neither did we. We talked about that a couple of times. Well, we, I, mean, I didn't think we had two great practices, but I think that when you're in this situation enough, you know, we've been in this game for uh, this, um, 15 out of my 17 years, yeah. basically, it's 18 without the COVID year, and we've been in this game, and we won it a lot, and, and get to the championship game, so we kind of know how to handle it. I think our guys do a great job of that. We don't put a ton of pressure on them, but we also want to make sure they play with the urgency you need to get to the next level. You know, you got to play this game before you get to the next one, so, you know, now that this is done, we'll get ready for York, who's a very good team again, and uh, we'll be ready in the in the rain, I guess. But I think that our guys have the right mentality, and I think that that's what I really like about them. And, and uh, we got great people. So we, we talked about some of the changes that you made from the first game against Eastern to yeah. this. Some of the defensive switches. Are there other things that you saw about the York game? That maybe similarly, not not that you're going to give away any of your game plan, but could there be some some changes they make, things that you do different well, for I the second? Some, yeah, I think some of the things we did today, you know, like uh, you know Ryan Quinn on 23 was a big change. You know, he really sh shut him down and did a great job at him, and uh, 10 on seven did a great job at him, and putting uh, and putting Nick inside to make some of those choices with his length did a really good job knocking down passes. And you know, we look at the game film again, like we have, and make those changes as York's going to make changes. You know, so we're going to be excited. You know, but obviously facing off and ground balls are going to be a big part of the game, and playing and uh, clearing the ball and. Uh, Obviously, and uh, shooting the ball. You know, it's going to be big things, but we'll be ready to go. And, you know, we're excited about it to, to get after it again, that's for sure. All right, coach, go win a championship. Appreciate you. Yeah, I got one of my best coming up here talking to you, Cam Leidig. He's been a three time captain for us and just a great guy. Got his 100th point today. And there's not a better role model about what Stevenson Lacrosse is all about than Cam Leidig. So we're just really happy for him to come up here and talk to you a little bit about his game today, which is awesome, and, you know, his experiences here at Stevenson. Love it, man. Thank you, coach. Appreciate you. You got it. It's Paul Cantabene.